Hello everyone, welcome to the SQLT channel. In this video, we are going to take a problem that deals with evaluating an expression. For the expression itself, we defined x as sum of five terms. And in general, we have the fifth root of 2 to the power of i. We have here from i equals to 0, then i equals to 1, which is going to be 2, i equal to 2, which is going to be 4, and then we have 8 and 16, as you see here. We are going to evaluate power of 30 of 1 plus 1 over x here. Let's see how we are going to solve that. To solve this, I'm going to add 1 to both sides of this equation. For the left hand side, it's going to be x plus 1, and for the right hand side, it's going to be 1 plus 1, which is 2, and the rest is exactly as what we had before. Now, based on this, we are going to do another trick. Basically, I'm going to write 2 as what you see here. The thing that I have here is basically, first of all, we have 32 equals to 2 to the power of 5. And if we take the fifth root of both sides, we can write it as 2 to the power of 5 to the power of 1 over 5, which is going to be 2. So I can do this, and based on that, we have sigma the fifth root of 2 to the power of i for i equal to 1 to 5. And this is defined as x plus 1. Now let's see how we are going to continue from here. First of all, what I'm going to do is really interesting. I'm going to factor out 1, the fifth root of 2 here. For the first one, it's going to be 1. For the second one, it's going to be what you see here. And finally, I can write it down as sum of values that you see here. From here, I'm going to say that I already know what this expression is. We define that as x in the original problem. So I can say that x plus 1 is basically 2 to the power of 1 over 5 times x. And if we divide both sides by x, since x is not 0, I'm going to end up with x over x, 1 over x equals to 2 to the power of 1 over 5. So I can say that 1 plus 1 over x is basically the fifth root of 2. And that's something that I'm going to continue with. To do this, remember what we wanted to find is power of 30 of the expression that we already found. And to find it, I'm going to write the fifth root of 2 as 2 to the power of 1 over 5. And then power of 30 of this is going to be 2 to the power of 6 which is basically 64 and we already have it here. Thanks for watching the video. If you would like to see more puzzles, maths involved activities and problems from different math competitions, please subscribe to this channel. I hope to see you in the next video.